you guys in for a trick today i'm gonna to unbox the nike air max sc oh my goodness look at that beautiful colorway i've always wanted a red pair of nikes ladies and gentlemen introducing the nike air max sc look at that beautiful colorway first thing i was attracted of the special colorway I wasn't even paying attention to the Nike Air Max, but of course we know the Nike Air Max design is a classic, which was created design back in the 80s. With its familiar design lines, heritage track look, and visible air unit, the Nike Air Max SC is the perfect finish to any outfit. Durable and lightweight materials meet the demands you throw at them, making them an easy choice for whatever your day has in store. So there you see, it features the leather upper classic Nike Air logo with the Nike Air unit, which isn't super flashy. It's on available and visible on both sides. And of course, this is a very unique colorway. It's very clean finish. Sometimes you just want a shoe that's not just all white and not all red, but if you combine them with this classic colorway, this is a must have that would fit in any outfit choice okay so what you're seeing is this is designed for running as so leather on the bottom but breathable mesh on the top so it's obviously not waterproof okay you got a night this is us men's size eight and a half so i wear about euro 41 so that's about 42 uh nike fits a little bit snug compared to other brands such as adidas so what it says in this Comfort insole. You got a special comfort insole on the interior, and here is the traction unit on the back, on the bottom. Very classic with the Nike logo and shoelaces, which is your standard shoelace with a Nike Air tongue. Very classy finish and look. Let's just see how flexible these are. For a running shoe, this is a good amount of cushioning. Standard Nike Air adds a little bit more height for shorter guys such as me and it's pretty semi-flexible making it ideal jogging shoe of choice Get over here Size eight and a half Sometimes for Adidas brand I can wear a size 8 because my feet measurement is about 41 So I got some Columbia pretty thick Athletic socks and that looks like a pretty good fit right here. I can fit one finger in the back and I have this much room in the front Maybe I could have did done with um, eight but half size bigger No problem, especially for jogging shoes. Sometimes you need some extra room in there. I Just realized something there's an extra shoelace hole right near the middle foot I believe that's if you want to thread it through there it adds greater stability so how do they look I'm going to base my shoe reviews on three criteria appearance comfort and value so in terms of appearance I really love the classic look especially when you combine with the colorway and the Nike Air Max logo and design, I give this a nine all day. As you can see, this is a pair of jogging shoes. As I'm jogging, I definitely feel the shoe being responsive and bouncy, especially helped by the Nike Air unit sole, which creates that comfort level. And it doesn't feel too snug or too loose because this is a standard fit, it feels good. It feels light to the touch. So in terms of comfortness level, I also give it also a nine. See how it's bending, okay. Even when I'm jumping, yeah, it feels very good. That's responsive and comfort. That's like a NBA or basketball shoe. Now in terms of value, I got this um, for a pretty good price. Online, you just have to do your research. So I also give that also a nine. So overall, this shoe is definitely fire because I love the classic look, I love the comfortness level, and I love the money savings.
So overall, this shoe gets a 9 out of 10. So if you are in the market for a classic pair of Nike Air Max jogging shoes, this is the one to get. That's the Nike Air Max SC. Big thumbs up.